more and more popular and you can now get an electric motorcycle. Yeah, Dave, uh, Dave, uh, our, yeah, our, yeah, the two Daves. The two Daves. Yeah. David Dave Dave. Davis <laughs> is here with Dave Stahl with yes. this cool electric car. And we motorcycle. have a friend named Laura as well. Yeah, I've been called a big zero before, but this really <laughs> is a big zero. Zero motorcycle. <laughs> and that's a positive. Th yes, this that, thing. That, yeah, exactly. Yeah. This is cool. Well, I like it. I, I've had them pretty much since their inception, and I've ridden them every year, and this last two years, I got them from Rocket Motorcycles, and Laura re represents Rocket mm -hmm. Motorcycles. Good morning. Here, let good me hop off here so you guys can me. get a better no view. Problem. We love having you out here, and I gotta tell you, man, this you, now there's been some quite a few improvements on this bike from last year. Why don't you throw a few oh, them out yeah. there? Well, now we have an anti-lock brake system, and we're using Shoah suspension now. Right, mm -hmm. and it makes all the difference in the world. I came just rolled in from Alpine with it. Pure, pure electric started with about 85. You know, percent. I still got over 50 percent here, and and you know, so there's no problem with me taking it out and riding it around. The other thing I really like about it is you can charge it up with 110. You know, you don't have to have a big 220 charger. You can buy this bike, put it at the house, plug it into the wall socket, leave it overnight. Boom, you're ready to go. Again. All right. So realistically, it's a city bike. You're not yes. going to be taking this to Sturgis. Sturgis, because you've got to charge it up, and it takes a while. It's a commuter. Yeah. It's a commuter right. bike. You ride this to say KUSI. Mm -hmm. You plug it into a normal 110 outlet. About how many miles would we get? Uh, 100, 150. 150. Yep, roughly yep. about right. that yeah. range. Okay. Well, as I've always said, it's not about range; mm -hmm. it's about terrain. So if you're doing a lot of hillies, yeah. then you're not going to get as much range. Sure. But if you okay. do uh, like San Diego, you know. But Dave, like you said, you've been doing this a few years now. This is gr this is the grown up version. This, this is, is, the grown -up this is version. it's getting better and better every year. Exactly. And there's my there's quite a few versions available you know if you're a dirt bike rider mm -hmm. they have one that's basically set up for the dirt if you want to just cruise with it they have cruiser bikes they have accessories that you can get one thing on this and i haven't showed you on it just with this little switch right here you can change the modes on how you drive it okay this little guy right, right. there okay in fact all you do is you get the gauge right here you got eco sport and custom so that's eco and then you got custom and then you got sport I'm going to leave it on sport. That will scare the heck out of me. <laughs> now, here's the other thing that's quite unique while you're doing I'm that. I'm listening. Yeah, I know you should be. Well, I'm riding, but I'm you're, listening. You never listen, but that's another story. <laughs> what are you showing me now? I'm going to show uh -huh. you. Right. Here, camera guy. My Zero app. Okay. Okay. So you have a Zero app, so you do settings, and you do drive setup. And here's again. I can adjust everything on this motorcycle through my iPhone. Tor okay. That's way too bit. high tech for me. No, but I tell you what, <laughs> I got you on full regen. All right. Got your helmet on. Very okay, good. Okay, watch this. Listen, listen to it when I start it. Rum, rum, it rum. started. Oh. That's so weird. Okay. But cool. Now, and, but how much do these things run? Approximately. So starting price is about 16K. Okay. But it depends like what kind of battery you get. So if you get a more powerful battery, it's going to run a little higher. Sure. But ultimately, this is a pretty good investment because it's low maintenance. The technology is really good. If this is going to be the bike that you ride to and from work every day, I think it's worth the money. For a buck and a half. <laughs> roughly exactly. enough. Within two or three years, you've made it up in gas. Oh, for yeah, sure. Less than that. Much. Yeah. Less than that. Now, okay. I put it on sport mode, so it's going to be oh, a little did. bit more. Well, Okay. Careful. All okay, right. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Careful, she says about her bike. Okay. Yeah. Here we go. Right. We'll be back in just a moment. Listen All to right. me rev this thing.